Brandon, you are the sweetest person I know. I'll see you later. Who's that girl you were talking to? Oh, you mean Theo? She's my bestest friend. Gosh, <laughs> she's so nice. And pretty. And sensitive. I like talking to her. Definitely way more fun than pumping out caramel lattes. Why do I get the feeling that judging people on how they look and feel is ever so slightly beyond you? Hogwash. If I couldn't analyze people, how would I know whether to recommend a daring dairy instead of a Tiancha? You said you liked some people more than others. Earlier, you thought of a joke. You're a sentient. You've got to be. <laughs> oh, stop it. You're making me blush. Which would mean I'm overheating and my circuits are frying. Not fun at all. That's what I thought. Take care, Brendan. Hey, V! You ready? Any idea how I can get to Hiromi? Pulled the blueprint, got it all figured out. Okay, not all, but we're good on the penthouse. Best bets to access it from the service level. Got a way in from there. All right. We going in? Let's do this. Don't want trouble. You two head in right after us. Go straight to clouds. About fucking time. Stay sharp. Gangoons might be lurking. Got a jack into the panel on the other side. Meet you. What then? Everyone all in position? Tom and Roxy should already be at Clouds. We go on Maiko's signal. They'll mop up security, you deal with Hiromi. But first, you gotta get into the penthouse. Okay. On my way. Elevators on the other side. Be safe. How's the sitch? We're inside at Clouds. Who's taking which floor? I'll take the lower level. Tom will head upstairs. We're all set. All right, on the roof. Jump down onto the balcony. Hide Careful my mark. Though, okay. Go! I'll be late. I told you, have shit tons of work. No, don't. <laughs> Security room. 
Finally, they're all jacked into virtues. It'd be game over otherwise. Right, wrong. Chicks will give you shit no matter what you do. This one's a real charmer, too. I don't like her either. Tries too hard. Can we get this over with? Why are there three guys? What's she playing at? That's our target, Hiromi Sato. Who are the other two? Target audience of today's presentation. Hiromi answers to them directly. Now they're gonna watch him die in a pool of his own piss. This is not what we agreed. Look at me. See this? This is a look of unfucking surprise on I my know face. The claws. To them, power is a question of strength, ruthlessness. This is the only way. Michael! I'm about to jack him out. They will not be chirpy after the rude awakening. One show ends, another begins. Just as good and unforgettable. Understand? Michael, our plan made no allowance for witnesses. A show of force, we said. And any show requires an audience. I know how this needs to play out, better than anyone. You gotta trust me. I thought this through many times. Do your thing. Well, she is no Barker. Wait, what's going on? Who is this? Living proof that Hiromi Sado's time is up. This merc has already disturbed the clientele at Clouds once. She murdered Oswald Forrest. And now she's invaded Mr. Sato's private residence. As if that were not enough, this is where Hiromi's sheer incompetence has led all of us to. What? What the hell? I have long looked upon Hiromi Sato's foolish, inept endeavors. But this? I think it's obvious he has outlived his usefulness. V, what the fuck she doing? Clouds need Judy, new I can't management. focus. Am I to What's understand that this future on? manager She's stands focused. before me now, speaking with such zeal? With your permission. Over my dead body. We were gonna Stop get rid me. of him. Am I to understand these as your conditions? Bored of all this v, chatter. Gotta take down. That's why Rather, we just cut to the quick. Now you're fucked! Fiend, what the hell were you thinking? Have you any idea what's gonna happen now? Matter of fact, I do. Either you walk away and never come back to Clouds, or I end you here and now. I see you got everything planned out, but you forgot just one thing. I've also got a doll chip. All right, V, get out of there. Exit's on the lower level of the apartment. Then find the elevator. Tom and Roxy are outside and safe. They weren't followed. Get down to street level, waiting by the food stalls. You... You killed her? Oh my fucking god. You killed her? Sorry, Judy. I, I didn't plan for it to happen. I know. Just give me a sec. I gotta gather my wits. I, uh... I gotta process all this in peace. Alone. Be seeing you, V. See ya, Judy. Oh, you... You again. Thank you once again for your help.
And yet, you did not help. Good intentions do not justify murder. Please, leave us in peace. Fine. Be my guest. Great. Just great. I ain't got a problem, Alex. Gonna take more than breaching one station to recreate the encryption key. Fuck. Give me a sec. Okay, got another station for you to try. Let's get to it. Good luck out there. And raise Reed as soon as you grab that encryption key.
Looking for something? Won't find it here. Nothing to find. Fucking stroke feels like. Perfect, Johnny. Thanks. Wasn't on purpose. Just gotta pick up the pace. Clock's ticking. I'm doing what I can. units a new disturbance has been reported All units in the area, order has been restored. All units instructed to return to patrol. How much you grow protein for? Get your friend. Here's to you, Carnalito. I don't think I'd recognize you on the street today. Hey, you made it. Got a head start. A drink to calm the nerves. Do this often? Drink solo? Often? Not the word I'd use. I wrote you because... Because I needed someone to talk to. Someone outside the firm. And not some total rando. To take my mind off the mission. Not worry about being someone else for a millisec. Hope that makes sense. Didn't want to be alone with your nerves, huh? 
<laughs> Always used to tell myself. Cut the jitters, Alex. You don't get nervous. But for a while now, I've been trying to be more honest with myself. I just want to be a normal fucking person for a little bit. Myself, specifically. Just me. Just Alex. I like the sound of that myself. Just shed this skin and leave the Night City Merc behind. Hey, yeah. Like, who are you anyway? <laughs> good question. With all this shit going on in my life lately, a damn good question. And definitely too soon to know for sure. Say, you ever think about who you'd be now? If, you know, life had taken a different turn? Maybe I'd still be with my family, out on the road. As in nomads? Mm-hmm. The backers. Probably somewhere in the Midwest right now, scraping together a few eds from the corn harvest. Then long conversations over beer. Isn't it time we join Snake Nation? Soaking in that big sky. Or the stink of chew in some rat hole motel. <laughs> or that. Okay, now you. Who would you be, if not a secret agent and master of disguise? An actor. No hesitation there. Always dreamed of seeing my face on a show bill. I love musicals especially. Seriously? <laughs> Call me old-fashioned. So yeah, guess I'd be a brain dance star. Hmm. <laughs> What's so special about musicals? The world in song is much more beautiful than in reality. Intensely so. Plus, I just like to dance. To our dreams. For they alone keep us sane. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? I love this song. Never know when which ways up down. It's never what it seems when it's all I'm ever missing. And it feels as though I'm waiting. And I don't need no head in my hands. No, I'm ever heading way south. Don't do this often, I'm guessing. This mean doing shit just cuz no forethought, carefree relaxing. I don't hear anything about it right now. Take down all of it is jaded somehow. Alex, thanks. I kind of forgot how much I miss the simple things, too. Don't mention it. See you soon. Ain't nothing without your help. Check out Ronald's Cream Stems. Sup, compadre? Okay, let's see what you can do for me. Just hope I won't regret it. Anything hitches, just come back. At least you won't get bored.
with Ronald Ronnie the Rock. Here we are. You and me, face to face. <laughs> 